Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Can I reach? I bet I can't reach from there. I can. I can. Now, I'm not sure how we're going to run all these poles yet. Um, but... We're going to start like this. And we can branch off of here if we need to. Have a good one, Timber. Take it easy, buddy. Now. This thing is going to power that thing. And I want to watch how these things kind of flow through again. It'd be super cool if this giant rock cliff wasn't here. Because then we could make this uh, a little bit cleaner. We could have a fifth over there and that would solve a lot of our look problems. But honestly, uh, it still looks pretty clean. I'm happy with it. Go take a smoke break while it works itself out. I want to see the point of entry. I want to see the point of entry. What I'm a little concerned about is like how much slower it's going to come out of here. Once we get the faster belts, I guess that will be uh, good. I don't know. Uh, let's flashlight this bad boy. So, okay. This is building. So it's ingesting faster than it's burning, which means we're good. We're super happy about that. That's awesome. This is, this is a fantastic setup so far. We're going to have a shitload of power. A literal shitload. Which is awesome. Now... I wonder... Hmm, I have an idea. I have an idea. That's right. That's right. Okay, we're gonna switch to um, the other walls. Because these walls... Pff, screw that. What's the outside? What's the inside? How do you know... What do you guys think? <laughs> which one's outside, which one's inside? We can have one less splitter with the coal pines? Yeah, we could. I just aesthetically like how it looks. I pick what I want? Ugh, really? Hmm. This is looking more outside to me, but this has like some cooler details. You know? Now, check this out. I have a plan, guys. I do have a plan, believe it or not. We're gonna have details out. Uh. Okay, I might need to organize this a little differently. But that's fine.
Accidental pings. Did I just tear up some floor? No. Uh, this can work. Yeah, this is gonna be okay. This will be alright. We'll take a splitter here. Will this grip to that? No, it won't. Okay. So, I think what's happening is when we build on the foundation, it has an automatic snapping system. And you hold the control and that overrides it. You know how it, in the bottom right it says hold control to snap to guideline? Uh, it's actually the opposite when you're building on these... Um, when you're building on the grid, it seems. What the? What the? Why? Oh, hold on, I'm done. Did I have this incorrect? Oh, I got this one. This one's weird. Beautiful. Gorge. As the guys on Queer Eye would say. Gorge! It's gorge. Like, absolutely, it's gorge. Anybody else watch Queer Eye? I'm not gonna lie, I love it. Probably my favorite show on TV right now. Does it spark joy for me? Yes. Yes, it does. Mm, I don't love my S curve. I don't love that curve, but whatever. Queer Eye. Yeah. You guys don't watch that? It's amazing, actually. It's really good. If you've never watched it, you should watch it. Basically what it is, if you've never heard of it, is uh, it's these five guys. Um, and they go and do, like, I want to say, like, life makeovers. for different people, and uh, it's really good. A lot of it's pretty inspiring. <laughs> this frickin' thing. A lot of it is pretty inspiring, actually. Pretty entertaining. They uh, give them, like, actual makeovers for their looks, but also they help them with their uh, house. They talk about, like, their family and any uh, psychological stuff that they're dealing with and that kind of thing. It's actually quite good. Okay! Wait, why is that stopped? Oh, it's already full. <laughs> Holy frick! Um, okay. Well, we've got power. We've got power! Why do I have trees on the way? I can't get rid of these trees. I can't. I can't buzz them down. I can't do anything. Um, so it's just how it is. I'm going to have to check how this one is over here too. Uh, for my wall setup. But for now...
Ooh, I wonder if that's going to be blocking me. Nope. Oh, that's so freaking close. So close. Okay. I'm going to snake it a little bit. Cheeky little snake. I don't know. Do you guys... It, for me, like this... <laughs> I shouldn't even say this because I might not want to know the answer. But like this is the part that I love the most. I like the... I like being able to refine this stuff. And... Uh, and make things just look exactly how I want. This is, like, this is the, the stuff that's super cool for me. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull this one off um, in a way that doesn't have, like, a really stupid bend. But. It's not bad. It's not bad. And again, same thing here. I wish we could um, control the angles a little bit better other than by using these poles. You're probably wondering why I'm using these poles, and that is literally the only reason. is so that I can control the angles of the, of the bend a bit more. Now the question is, do we do power poles inside or do we po do power poles outside? I get that there's hazards, but we could, like, hide some of them away and we could run uh, cables through the walls and stuff. We should probably do them outside. I think we should probably do them outside. She's hot. I'm going to move this one as well. We should have a door to the outside. Oh, don't don't even, don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. It is 100% happening. Okay, now I'm going to try and close in the rest of this area. What, seriously? I burned through all that fuel while it was sitting there. I really don't like that. You have to manually take the fuel out. I have a bad feeling about getting up this hill. I have a bad feeling about getting up this hill. Factory not OSHA approved. Well, I mean, this this is just our our power area, and uh, honestly, the idea here for me is to just not have to deal with it, not have to even look at it after we um, build it. It's just going to be like, let me see if I can do this. Okay, let's get some speed. Holy hell, that's frustrating. Hey, Rigro, what's up, man? How are you, buddy? Can't you trim down the power settings below 100? Yeah, we might be able to. I'm just running it for now, because we can. Okay, I've been defeated by this goddamn hill one more time. The hill has defeated us. Like this tight little spot. I just need to get the goddamn truck out of here, okay? I don't even know if I'll make it over here. I 
There we go, baby. Come on. Chug! Easy. Oh, man. Uh, Paco, thanks for the 15 months, man. Uh, Todd, thanks for the 15 months. Calmo, thanks for the 17 months. Dude, thank you, guys. That is very nice. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so all of these are obviously just clogged. Um, it chews through this so slowly. We could probably get, on our, on our one coal source, we could probably split this into way more. And even if we overclock it, right? Um, we can underclock, but is there, a, is there a downside to just having this running at maximum speed? Not really. Is it because it's not hurting us? Nothing's happening. Everything's just kind of at a standstill, right? So, anyways. Uh, ooh, that's going to be weird, isn't it? Because I don't have foundation out there. I will. It's building it. I don't know how. But it's doing it. Hmm. Oh, I got it. Okay, here we're going to do like... Um, this is going to be our regular doors, I guess. Or... We could do a gate. A double gate opening. Now let's just do a single gate. Single gate. I'm feeling a single gate. Okay. So the idea is going to be... Close this all in. Tractor fit through the gate? The tractor will fit through the gate, yeah. I don't think it closes, though. Good question. But I don't think it closes. Because what's nice about doing it like this is all of that production is kind of hidden. Behind this massive factory wall. The next thing that we'll have to do is, um, oh, whoops. See, and look, I'm not clipping the wires or anything. Now, I'd like to actually build over and around this, too. Do we do black walls? It's kind of cool, actually. Oh! <laughs> uh. I just thought of something else. I got, I got a better idea, actually. I got a better idea. So it'll only take a minute. <laughs> so it'll only take a minute. Oh my god! Don't worry, I have more ammo in the truck. 
five more months. <laughs> Dude, so I'm telling you, this is gonna like... We... <laughs> I don't wanna talk about it. Um... Oh, I can't even make more. I don't have any more. I thought I put some on the truck, but it's in our storage at the base. It's in our storage at the base. You get the idea, okay? You get the idea. You know what we're going for. We'll get there. We'll finish that up later. Um, let me grab more concrete. Yeah, good. Uh, you, oh, you're checking to see if this, if I matched the sides? Yeah, of course I did. What is this, amateur hour? Yes, kind of. Kind of is. I guess we can have it scanned for power slugs. Uh, sounds like there's one back there. Now, what I'm wondering is... Let's build from the inside here. That one will not do. That has to be switched. I don't know how this is going to work around that, um, around here, but we're about to find out. I don't know why it switches it sometimes. This is literally the most perfect music. Alright, we just found out what our height needs to be. Uh, it's too bad that I couldn't do something here, like that these walls are a little too close to this thing. Um, what I could do... <laughs> uh, if I really wanted to... I could like isolate this out of the factory and like build around it, but I don't I actually don't think we need to. <clears throat> hey coffee, thanks man. Appreciate that. Minimum requirements for the game high? Uh I don't know. I it feels like it might be pretty demanding, to be honest with you. Anyways, this is like the basic this is the basic setup for our uh, power. This is going to be like our power plant. And pretty much all power is going to stem from here. And we will... Um, we'll build that out to our place up top. Now, speaking of up top, let's drive up there, shall we? I think the next thing we probably want to invest some time in is uh, trying to get supplies from from our base to here, automated, with these tractors. What time is it? Jesus! Why isn't my tractor making any noise? Pfft, who cares when you've got a 20 Ti, am I right? <laughs> yeah, am I right? 20 Ti, 20 ATI is for suckers. Time flies. Yeah, no, honestly. Um, I hope you guys are, like, I hope you guys enjoy this. Because I'll be doing this for a while. I bet you the slug is up there.
I'm not sure how the trucks work um, with automating them, so uh, we'll kind of experiment with that tomorrow, I think. But uh, I just want to show you guys, in case you weren't here at the beginning of the stream. I'm running right at a slug, I guess. Where did it go? Yeah, it's got to be up top. Anyways, we'll get there. Um, we'll do that tomorrow. Let me turn this off. Check out these nodes that we're going to be working with. So we've got our power set up down below. And then we're going to kind of build out a big foundation in this area that's like between all these rock cliff faces and stuff. And then um, we've got three pure iron ore right here. Okay, no big deal, you might be thinking. Up there, we've got pure limestone. Over here, we have another iron ore. And then in the back there where that plant is, we've got uh, copper ore. Let me go kill this plant and show what's up with the new stuff. You love the little wrench in the sword? That's yeah, super cool. The animation's nice too. Yeah, yeah, it's super nice. Oh, Oh, this is so much better. Here's the wood that we dropped earlier. And this is pure copper ore. Everything's pure. Everything is pure over here. It's sick. So, um, yeah, I think that's going to be the plan. Is tomorrow we automate bringing stuff from the other place. And I'm guessing... Look, I, I we'll figure it out as soon as we build one. But um, this truck station here. So we build the truck station. Configure it. Uh, we say it's loading or unloading. So let's say we're unloading here. We pr we set a truck. We set a truck station at the other place. It takes a long time, obviously, but it will kind of automate things for us. We don't have to think about it too hard. Um, I imagine. Yeah. So we're gonna have to run things in from storage containers into the truck station, I guess. And then we'll have a truck that just goes back and forth. Um, I don't know how to. If, I don't know if I have to program the truck or if it will automatically go from truck station to truck station. Do you guys know? Uh, they will. They do run on fuel, but they will use fuel that's in the trucking station, is my understanding. It says so over here. Always refuels vehicles that have access to a matching fuel type. You need to make the path manually. Okay, so we'll have to like do one run. Back and forth? That's where the recording comes in. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. That is awesome. So I think that's what we'll spend some time on uh, tomorrow. And we'll also, of course, get these uh, mining things up and running. We'll have to build out a bunch of foundation in this area, chop some of these trees. But this, this, I think we just put down foundation literally everywhere, right here. This becomes our we, we can even, like, divide it into sections and stuff. We have so many opportunities. We can do whatever the hell we want. Um, we need to build some stairs up there. I might even actually do jump pads to get up top there. And then we could do another jump pad to land and a jelly to land on the other side. And that way, if we need to go back and forth, which we shouldn't often, but if we do, we'll have cool traversal um, of that. So, Feeling much more relaxed than way earlier. Were you feeling a little bit overwhelmed? Like... Uh, just at the amount of stuff that's in the game. I can, I can totally see that. For me, it's like... It's nice that you can... You can... It's just a sandbox. Literally, it's just a sandbox. So you do whatever the hell you want. If you're feeling stressed, well, figure out a way to automate it and make you feel less stressed. You know. I should just set a jelly down at the bottom here. <laughs> can we expand Canadian Empire after this? What does that mean? Are you talking about, uh, Civ? Walkway across the gorge? Yeah, maybe, maybe that's what we should do, actually. Because navigating our, um... Navigating our... Whatchamacallit? Our tractor is a goddamn nightmare. But maybe I could just build a bridge. All the way across. Let me take a look here. That's where we came from. Uh... That is scary intimidating, but let's just see. A player is in the way. I don't believe it. Yeah, 
encroaching. Oh. This is going to be our bridge. And uh, we'll build, like, walls and stuff for it. <laughs> it's going to be... It's actually... This might be, like... This could become the centerpiece of the entire operation. We could even split it off to go to different um, sections, like down there. This little island. We could have, like, a just a little ramp down there. Hell yeah, dude. We can do whatever we want. My door just rang. One second. I'll come say bye to you guys in two, 2.5. back. Can I show you guys what I got from the Zon? Hey, Penetrator, it's been a minute. How are you, buddy? Dude, how do I not have a five more minutes emote? Like, what the frick am I doing with my life? Is this Minecraft for grown-ups? Yeah, pretty much. Bob, how are you, buddy? Mathoba, thanks for the 24 months, by the way. Uh, let me show you guys what I ordered from from Amazon. Yeah, this is the path for the truck sites. I'm pretty excited about this. This is this is for the stream. I bought this with my own money. This is not sponsored. This is uh, a Go XLR. Check this out. <clears throat> so basically. Basically, um, it's got ways to like route out of all of your audio and stuff. But for me, what I want to do is get into like um, some like voice effects and stuff. The idea I had, the, the, what prompted this idea, was um, was uh, the Division Two, and I was like, oh, it'd be super cool if sometimes you could do like the uh, just like simple things, like do like the um, sounds like your voice is on like the CB radio or the comms or whatever. And this has a bunch of stuff. You can also cue in, like, um, different samples and things. Just, like, fun stuff, you know? Is the world in this game flat? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Make path. Oh, too wide so you can have multiple trucks going. I think they'd probably fit side by side on this. Anyways, I don't even have enough frickin' sandbags to make this happen. Oh, I'm pumped to have a bridge. I'm so pumped. Look at this. Now, I don't, I, I mean, okay. Like, how is it standing? Well, it doesn't matter. Okay? It doesn't matter how it's standing. I'm gonna go over those trees, too. I'm ramping up, and I'm going over those trees. It is happening. It's happening. You're gonna need... Yeah, I am gonna need to ramp it up, exactly. Anyways. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stop now, because if I don't... I just, I just keep going. And, uh... When this gets up and running, oh, this is going to feel so good. I'm actually not sure what I should do first tomorrow because I feel like um, our production isn't fast enough. Like, we're not making enough resources over there because we're busy doing all this other fun shit. But whatever, man. Whatever. Let me just get... Where's my truck at? It's over here. Can't wait to see the tractor jump off the bridge. Yeah, probably. I'll automate it so it does it every time. <laughs> we'll call it the suicide run. It's going to be great. 
It's going to be the best bridge you ever saw. And uh, before we leave this area too, um, I'll build a... You know what? Frick it. I'm just going to do it right now. Anyways. God. <laughs> I'm just going to do it right now. It's just going to be like a random storage container. Okay? That's all. It's just a random storage container. And... Oh, look. I actually do have a lot of stuff. I do actually have quite a bit. Hold on. I could maybe get the bridge across. Maybe. This is just temporary, okay? So don't like... Oh, I'm missing iron plates. Wait a sec. Don't get all like juiced up about this, okay? This is literally just to kind of hold all of our stuff. Okay. And we would use this to build the bridge. Okay? You see what I'm saying? I do need uh, something like this. But that's pretty much all we would need to go back. And then we can grab new supplies when we're there. Yeah, they don't really hold that much. Hey, you look at this and you look at our personal storage, it's not that much different. But there are some upgrades back at the base that um, upgrade the capacity of these. So we'll do that as well. Guys, look at, you know, we don't have any paint in the paint gun. We ran out of paint. Uh, but you see what we're going for? We could do some cool stuff. We could even, I'm just throwing it out there. We could pull it off, but we could like draw stuff on there, pixel art style. I might do it one day, we'll see. I might do it one day. Okay, yeah, let's end on the bridge. Good call, you guys. Great idea. You guys are all freaking super smart. Let's end on the bridge. Thank you so much for being here. I'll, uh, I'll be on again tomorrow. At, um... Man, today I was gonna start... I, I said I was gonna start at 1, so I did. But I was gonna start at 12, because I had the extra time. Um... Yeah. Hold on. Mm. Pull back. Pull back. Do you guys know how I can, like... Do you guys know if there's a way to go into third person at all for, like, photos and stuff? Uh, what time do I start tomorrow? So I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna say... I'm gonna... I'm gonna say... One o'clock. Oh yeah, no, we definitely can't do two on here. Look at how creepy that is. Ah! Drop the weapon, otherwise you cannot take a picture. Whoa. No, you, you can do it. Um, but I, I don't know if you can go into like, um... I don't know if you can go into third person. That's what I would really like. I feel like my truck isn't making noise. Which is weird, but whatever. Uh, build it. See, building these ramps is a pain in the... It's a pain in the berries. It's a pain in the berries. I think, I think we're going to put, uh, over time, we're going to put a lot of work into this bridge. Because I kind of want this to be the centerpiece of our entire operation. 
uh, just to show that it can be done. I can't figure out if there's a faster way of doing this, but this seems all right. This goddamn tree. I'll be chopping that down. It's gotta go. Anyways, you see what's happening here? <laughs> Ooh, this is great. This is great. I'm going straight over this tree. I'd actually, I'd like to keep the tree here. Um, I wonder if I... I wonder if I changed my ramp size here. I mean, it's pretty good. Just five more minutes, okay, guys? God, this is... Oh, my base is so freaking far away from here. Oh no. Oh, I thought I fell. I thought I was falling. I thought I was falling. Just one more time. <laughs> the tractor has power, yeah. Yeah, it has the power for it. You mean to get up that steep hill? It does, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ten more hours? Okay. Ten more hours. Can I just save my game? I just want to save my game once. Alright. End on the free fall, it, it could happen. I have an idea about when I reach um, that little cliff on the left there. Can we make a tower to space and view the whole planet from above? <laughs> yeah, you probably can. You just need materials. Which is going to be the biggest problem to this situation. I like that they- I think their balance for materials is pretty good. Like, you don't want to have to sit there and just grind materials forever. Um, I actually feel like they've kind of nailed that aspect and you can build things that are not um, necessarily functional and focus on form. If you want to. Do you guys think we're going to make it on these supplies? It's going to be close. It's going to be close. One short? <laughs> I would, you're probably right. With my luck. 
You really want this to come to console? I don't know about that, man. Uh, Luffa72, thanks for the 10 months. And Zeitz, thank you for the bits, buddy. Five, 500 bits for five more minutes. Okay. You don't even gotta pay me, dude. Like, I'll just do this for free. <laughs> this, is, this is the greatest. I feel like I, I lost my rhythm there. Okay, we're back. We got it back. God, that number is dwindling hard. I can see our base, though. Like, when we look back... Remember we saw the fog? I kind of loved that. We are going to have to... Um, as we say, we're, eventually if we want to get multiple trucks going, we're going to need to... Uh, make more space on this thing. I don't think we're going to have enough, guys. So, um... Hold on. Ooh, what is that? Squeeze me. Oh, I, t <laughs> I have to build them with... I have to build ramps. I can only build ramps at the moment. Because uh, I, this is all the stuff that I have. How come I can't snap this in front? Help? How come I can't put that in front? No, I don't want to jump. I don't want to jump. I can't snap a foundation in front of this. Am I uh, crazy? 8x2 foundation for 8x4 ramp? Oh, is that what I'm doing wrong? So awkward, like... Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Oh, that's why. I'm actually... No, I'm not. Never mind. And I don't want to jump off because I want to have a way of getting back up. That's fine. <laughs> Holy frick. This is a disaster. Um, 
The problem is... Oh, do not. Do not knock me off of here. The problem is I don't have any other supplies to build uh, walkways. So I have to build it with these ramps that are like super awkward for me. I just want that. Is that so hard to ask? No! Oh, you bitch. Don't worry, I have a plan. <laughs> like always, obviously. This is so awkward. Come on now. Easy. Mercer Sphere. Ah, oh, work in progress? What? Why? Why? I don't even want to see those. If I can't use them. Okay, well, anyway. Um, we're a little short. And that's fine. We have enough for some little ramps. I think I'll wrap it up here. We're super close to our base. Uh, we can complete the bridge. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. That's amazing. We can complete the bridge from our base. And we'll just uh, pick up from there and do whatever else we need to do. Okay, I'm actually stopping now. I'm actually stopping now. Finish bridge. Get supplies. Okay. This is basically how I memorize stuff when I play games, by the way. I have to, like, write my save names. Okay, I'm done. Okay, I'm done, guys. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. We're going to be here uh, back tomorrow. Uh, I say 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock p.m. <laughs> 1 p.m. Eastern time, okay? And uh should be fun. Should be fun. Thank you for being here. I'm going to see if I can come over the five more minutes emote. Maybe I could ask Crafty. Crafty? Crafty? Think we could work on a five more minutes emote, please? That'd be sick. Guys, thanks for being here. I really appreciate it, honestly. Um, this was super cool. We'll pick up uh, from here tomorrow and have a good time, okay? All right. Bye-bye.